being in my uh, country kitchen here. Today I'm going to present you how to make my uh, mama's uh, low budget lasagna. <laughs> um, it's very simple. Uh, she needs a pound of ground beef. Uh, I, well, I use three medium tomatoes, half of a brown onion, uh, three garlic cloves, and I put uh, my seasoning, you know, you can put it to your choice. So uh, I put uh, Italian seasoning, oregano, uh, pepper, onion powder, garlic powder, and um, a little salt. And I think that will, that's it. That'll do it for salt for the, for this part. All right, so I'm making the uh, the meat filling. It's actually done. Smells really, really wonderful. So now I'm going to pour three cans of tomato sauce. Really simple. Nothing fancy. Just tomato sauce. And then I put uh, a tablespoon spoon of uh, crushed pepper and a tablespoon of sugar. So I'm going to stir all this up together. It's going to be so good. This is for the meat filling. And then I'm going to pour a little bit of uh, chicken broth. I don't know. Whatever you think is right for you. Look. Swanson chicken broth. Mm. There it goes. Voila, there it goes. All right, so um, my sauce is done. So now what I'm going to do is I have combined, I put cottage cheese with the seasonings, which is um, onion powder, garlic powder, pepper, basil, oregano, um, and a little bit of salt. Now I'm going to just throw in a little bit of this. Um, so I'm mixing in Parmesan and mozzarella into the cheese mixture here that I've got. I'm not going to use all of it. I'm just going to use, you know, some of it here, which it's up to you. I think it's probably probably a cup that I put in there of the mozzarella cheese because it's for this the cheese sauce, which it looks good already. Uh, I might have to put a little more because what it is, I'm saving this for the, the tops. Cause I need it for two tops. Cause I'm doing, you know, the two layers. So this is probably, you know, just right, right here. And I put all that seasoning in there. And then my spinach, I will put that in there also. When I put that in there, I'll put that on the top of that, the layer. Okay, so everything is all about building layers with lasagna, that's what it is. So I'll be building some layers here uh, spinach, the cheese, and the filling, and the sauce. And we'll go from there. So, um, I've thrown my uh, uh, sauce in there. So now I'm going to put my uh, cheese sauce and, um, you know, just spread it a little bit here and there. Sometimes your, your lasagna falls, it could fall apart a little bit, you know. So you kind of piece it up too. Don't throw it away. You piece it up because that happens a lot of times. Still good. It doesn't have to be perfect because you would cut it up and it's not all perfect. So anyway, now I'm going to throw, you know, the uh, spinach in there. And the spinach will, you know, shrink, of course. It's, it's you know, like a half a bag of spinach. So I'm going to throw in a lot, but it, it's not going to look like a lot. It'll shrink. And now I'll put a, you know, the cheese mix, the cheese uh, parmesan and mozzarella in here, in this layer, like that. That's a lot of cheese. Buddy doesn't like that all cheese, but Buddy's gonna have to eat this. This is dinner. All right. So last, I will um, throw the rest of the mixture here. Put the spinach in there too, and then I will cover it for 35 minutes in a 450 degree oven and I will leave it in there for uh, 35 minutes um, and then I'll cover it 
for 10 minutes so it can get a little crisp on it with the cheeses and all that. All right, so this is what it looks like. I took the cover off and then I put it back for 10 minutes. And um, when my kids, you know, Marina, Brian, and my little buddies to eat this, this, it was our little budget lasagna. We loved it. 